the format of being robot. Being a big fan of Nickelodeon shows from the 1990s, I was very disappointed when Nick Games and Sports ended in 2007. Well about a week ago, I was channel surfing late at night, when I saw Nick Games and Sports in the lineup. I instantly assumed it was some sort of error. Nick Games and Sports had been closed for quite some time now, why would it be broadcasting today? I started watching a rerun of Figure It Out. About halfway in, I noticed something weird. The color was way off, and the contestant, the kid with the talent, was nowhere to be seen. I tried to keep watching, but it abruptly ended and quickly cut to the network bumper. Things quickly got horrifying. The kid on the bike was lying on the skate park floor, with a bloody handlebar jutting through his chest. The rest was a static ridden mess. I tried to convince myself it wasn't real. Maybe the signal got screwed up, or maybe we have another Max Headroom hacker. I ignored it and continued watching. Up next was what I thought was Legends of the Hidden Temple, but this was different. Almec looked pissed about something. The announcer just stood there blankly, and the kids were nowhere to be seen. Then it cut to Team Red Jaguars trying to cross the moat, only to get brutally concussed and drowned. Mortified, I tried to turn it off, but my cable box kept giving me the same error message. Could not complete requested action. Please try again later. I tried to unplug it, but my cable box's battery was fully charged. It would be at least another hour before the thing would die. I decided to keep calm, and just let it run its course. The next shot was of the blue barracudas attempting the temple run. They abruptly stopped. I was treated to a shot of their mangled corpses embedded in a pit of spikes. Again, mortified and desperate, I tried to unplug the output cable. I couldn't see anything in the dark. I tried to convince myself that it was all some sort of elaborate hoax. The last show was Double Dare. It started out mostly normal, Mark asked the questions, and the kids would suck at answering them. I was relieved, to say the least. But then the physical challenge started. Dear God, the physical challenge! The kids were given AK-47s, and forced to kill one member of the opposite team. The red kid, crying, shot the blue kid's mom. Mark then laughed demonically, and proceeded to murder the red kid's mom. The corpses were bloodied and lying on the floor, intestines and guts ripped out. I couldn't take it anymore. I poured a can of Fanta on my TV and short-circuited it, cable box and all. I've since received a replacement, but I have a bit of a problem. Last night, Nick Games and Sports showed up in the menu, 